Hello and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Caitlin and I absolutely love to make a lot of DIY home decor, but I also enjoy showing you all everything that I pick up that I am uh, going to use in DIYs. Hopefully, fingers crossed, if all goes well and nothing happens, by next, the beginning of next week, I will have a video on Target DIYs that I'm super excited about. It has some really cute stuff planned. But before I get started in that, I wanted to bring you along today and show you everything that I did pick up from Target in their dollar spot or bullseye playground, whatever you want to call it. And I was just so excited with everything that I got. I was kind of sad because I've been seeing everybody else on Instagram getting tear trays and tobacco baskets and pillows. And everything was pretty bare and either picked over or they didn't get a lot in the first place. I don't know. Uh, me and my husband are, fingers crossed, going on a date night this weekend. Um, I don't know if that'll be tonight or tomorrow night. And we are going to be driving a little bit, so I'm hoping that we do pass another target or two. So I will get to stop in and see if um, hopefully they haven't sold out of all of their stuff. But don't worry, even though they didn't have the big items, I did find a way to spend a bunch of money and come home with bags full of things. So they still had a lot of cute stuff and I want to share with you everything that I got. So if you're not already, make sure you are subscribed and give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoy watching haul videos. So the first thing that I picked up was an assortment of these signs. And this one says, I love fall most of all. This one says, let's stay home. This one says, meet me at the pumpkin patch. And I'm so glad we live in a world where there are um, Octobers. I just think this looks so farmhouse and so pretty. These were $5 each, but you get two signs. And I thought these would be so perfect, like staging, um, not only for my videos, but actually like putting in my home decor, like just setting these signs around. Um, I think they actually have hangers on them, but I don't really put a lot of small items on the wall, like a hutch, or on a shelf, on a table. They also have this one uh, that has the buff buffalo. <laughs> they also have this one that has the buffalo uh, print on this side, but I think that's so pretty. And this is definitely DIYable. It's already got that for the background. So I definitely want to be doing something with these, and I love the wood frames. Some of them have wood frames, and then some of them have the whitewashed frames. So really pretty finds, and I'm so excited because that is a good price, $2.50, for these nice quality wood signs. I also picked up a couple ceramic pumpkins. They have this tall gray one, which was $3, and then this little squatty or burnt orange color, and it was $3. And I don't have any pumpkins that is this burnt orange color, but I just love it. I think it is so pretty and such soft tones, and they look really good together. Also, in the pumpkin section, they had these little wooden uh, pumpkins, and this was $3. I actually think this is a little bit pricey. It's a nice, heavy, thick quality wood, uh, but for $3, and it's just kind of plain. I mean, it's cute, but anyways, I thought this would be a really cute DIY project. I really like how wide it is, so it does freestand by itself. But this will be pretty uh, setting with, with other things. It looks more Halloween-ish with the black on the sides, so I do want to try to paint this and make it go more with my everyday fall decor. I picked up a bag of these uh, little burnt orange pumpkins, and these were $3. They were really pretty as well. I like how they have a little speckled effect to them. But they're just um, creams and browns and reds in there. I think they were really cute. And this would be perfect for little basket fillers. I made that little DIY wagon, so th these would be really cute in there. I also found this little wood word that says home. This was $3. And I think this is really pretty as is. You definitely could paint it, but I love the little wood grain in there. So um, I wanted to try to use this on a DIY as well. But uh, Target has a lot of stuff that is perfect for DIYs. I'm so excited for next week's video. I hope it turns out really cute. But I have a lot of neat ideas. And uh, this is really nice quality. This has been like laser cut, I guess. But this is really nice. They also had these little picks, and these are a dollar each, but they are really nice quality. This one doesn't have a lot on it, but these do. I really like them. This says eucalyptus boxwood pick, but I think this is really cute. Um, I got a lot of coffee mugs, so I thought it would be cute to make a little uh, greenery piece to set down in those coffee mugs. They also had this little boxwood uh, sprigs for a dollar, and... I mean, you can definitely go to Dollar Tree and get larger, uh, bigger greenery pieces, but they're not this high quality, and this just looks like realistic. So I can put this down in my coffee mugs and make like a little bouquet for just a couple dollars. Target had out these cute little metal mugs, and these also are kind of speckled. 
This was $3. I'm just going to use this as decor, but um, it says it is 17 ounces and not dishwasher safe. <laughs> so I probably won't use that, but I did think that this was really cute and we go with farmhouse decor. To match that mug, they also had these little speckled candles, except these are like ceramic with a candle in there. They have ginger pumpkin and misty morning, and they smell really, really good. They smell like expensive candles and they were three dollars each but these are so pretty I love these these are such nice quality they have the little buffalo check paper in there so I don't want to take that out I think that's so cute but these are so pretty this one looks uh, white with a little black speckled and the black rim on there and this one is gray with white trimming but so pretty and very nice quality I think I just blew dust in my face but um, these will be so pretty sitting around the kitchen or even setting one on your stove Another find that I was so excited about was these eat letters, and these are wooden decor wall letters. I have a hanger on the back of each of them. These are cut out and high quality and have like the wood. They're actually, um, I guess they're really MDF, but they have like the wood finish on the front and they're kind of heavy, so they're really nice quality and they're really big. So this is super fun for a DIY. Uh, if you did want an eat sign for your kitchen, this would be a super easy way to get it. One of my favorite things that I found was this letter board and it says let's be cozy and it actually has the little wood pieces in there. They come in the back and these just feel like nice quality. I had purchased one of these a while back somewhere and I didn't end up keeping it as long at all because the letters were so thin and I didn't think that it was going to last very long anyways and the kids were playing with it. But this one actually seems um, like something that I can put up on a shelf. It's small enough to set up or also hang up on the wall, I guess. But I think this is really cute. It would be so fun writing different things on here for fall and Christmas and taking photos and stuff. So I think this is a really good buy. This was $5 and it's really heavy and made on pretty sturdy. Although this says photo props, um, it comes with a ton of different, I guess these are card stock, cardboard, I don't know little colorful shapes and items and I thought this would be so fun there's like a piece of pumpkin pie and there's a truck in there a little navy truck that has pumpkins in it so there's a ton of different items in here they have sunflowers and a scarecrow so I thought this would be fun to try to make something out even if it's not like home decor this would be so fun to make a little cards with or uh, even tear the little stick off and put these on your fridge, like attach magnets to them. They were just too cute to leave there. This one says football. We're not really into football in my family, but um, these are really cute. They even have a little caramel apple. So these are so cute and so colorful and uh, definitely a good buy. These were $3, so this is um, something that I cannot make at home. So I just went ahead and got that. Even if it's something I don't use, my girls would absolutely love to have these. Something that I hadn't seen before in the Target Dollar Spot, maybe there have been, but I haven't seen that in mine, uh, but was this cutting vinyl. I went ahead and got white and gold, and it says peel and stick vinyl. And even if you don't have a Cricut or a Silhouette machine, you can just kind of draw what you want out with pencil or trace it, uh, something off the computer, or try to go around it and cut that out and then use it like a Cricut, and you're just spending like a dollar. So you don't have to buy like a big roll um, if you are wanting a little something labeled, but this would be so cute to put little hearts out of. You could write with permanent marker on little hearts and label something, or you could uh, just cut out a big letter. I don't know, the possibilities are endless, but I thought this would be something fun to try to incorporate into a DIY using these um, little pill and stick vinyl sheets. They have a lot of little signs. Um, I picked up this little gray one that says home sweet home. It's gray with the gold lettering. And this was $3 and you can even like kind of paint over those letters and give it a different look if you want to. I picked up this turquoise pumpkin with all intentions on DIYing this. I absolutely love the shape of it. I love how it's raised up in the center and this was $3 and it's really nice quality. Um, it even has a hanger on the back too, but I thought that this would be so pretty painted a different color. Even if you just wanted to paint it a solid color and set it around, I still think that it is so cute. This isn't really decor, but I picked up this little wall banner, and I love how they leaving them, how they are leaving them blank, so that you can write what you want to on there. If you were having like a birthday party, you could write somebody's name on there and write like the age in this little wreath. But these are three dollars, and they have like the little canvas paper. I think this is so pretty, and I love the colors of it. 
they had a little apple section. There was a lot of apple stuff. So I picked up this caramel apple bar for $3. And we don't ever have a caramel apple bar or a lot of apples. So I thought this was something I might try to paint over as well. But it's really pretty and I really like how thick it is and that it can just free stand once again like that pumpkin earlier. So these are really neat signs and um, this was the only one, the only single one that they had. So I'm really hoping that I can find uh, different versions of these. Target knows that we are all about DIYing. So they put out a lot of wood items. This actually was $3 and it's this little circle hanging sign. I actually took a wooden circle from Dollar Tree and I did a Dollar Tree video last fall. I'll link that down below and put it in the cards. It was so cute and you all loved my little home sign that I made with a circle. So I will link that down below and go check that out if you haven't already. I picked up a ton of these wooden letters. I thought that these would be so fun to personalize friends or my own thing. Or I even got the letters to spell out fall. So I don't know what I'll do with these. These were a dollar a piece. So I do need to use them because that would have been one, two, three, four, five, six bucks on these. <clears throat> but they are just so cute and high quality and perfect to add to little DIYs. I know that I got some white little pumpkin trays last year. But these are like the burnt colored orange. And these are three dollars. These are really nice. I really like these and just really pretty. This is something that you could put on a little easel, so set it up on a shelf or something you could lay down and use as a tray. Something else that I've never seen at Target Dollar Spot are these really large wall decor pieces. Uh, this is cute as it is, but I still feel like it needs something. So I want to give this a makeover and try to make something really pretty out of it that I can hang up in my home. And these are just really big and nice. They have the real grooves in there. So this is just perfect to DIY and make something really pretty out of that. I found another one of these little banners in my uh, stash over here, but this one says customize. I thought it actually said welcome, but it says customize, so that's even better. So I can make this into something that I would like to, but this is like that little kind of wood material. So this would be perfect for all of your DIYs and you can make this like really cute and customize it and then take a couple off of the end if you just want to use them as single little pieces. I also picked up some of these chalkboards. I saw everybody else getting these and I thought I needed them but these can go up and down or sideways and my favorite thing to use on these is those chalk pens from Walmart or you can order them on Amazon and it's just not really dusty and doesn't sm smudge. You have to use water to get them off but it works really nice on chalkboards. This was $5 for a pack of four, and they really do have like real wood frames, so I thought this was a really good deal. My Target didn't have a lot of Halloween stuff, so that's something else that I want to look for tonight. Um, I have been seeing some of that other places, but mine didn't have any, so that's why all of this stuff is full. I did see a couple of Halloween towels, but they just weren't my favorite, so I didn't get those. I got this one that says Our Nest. This is definitely something you can use all year. It has little tassels, which I absolutely love on the bottom of that one, and it's like a white with the greenish or grayish, grayish stripes, and then the front says Our Nest. So I thought this was a really good buy. This was $3 for two hand towels, and they are really cute. I had no idea that I kept getting all these banners. I guess I just, I don't know, I like them. This one says reversible. It has fall and two leaves on one side and then family on one side. And this was $3 too. So really cute. It's kind of like a little canvas material on the background. And then the last thing that I picked up was this little apple sign. It says fresh hat. It says fresh and hot apple cider served daily. I thought this was really cute and just so pretty and you could definitely DIY this if you wanted to paint over it or it's beautiful as it is. And this was $3 and you could just uh, assemble this if you wanted to but I think it is a beautiful piece and perfect for hanging up on the wall. So I got a lot of fun new things and like I say watch out for that video make sure you are subscribed hit your notification bell so you never miss an upload and it will alert you whenever I post my new video. So that's coming at the beginning of next week I'm not sure the day yet but I'm going to try really hard to get that up as soon as possible. So make sure you are subscribed and give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and let me know in the comments below an awesome find that you got at Target because like I say I do want to have this video up today and I'm going on my date tonight so I will be able to see your comments and let me know uh, something to look for other than like the 
the tear trays, the pillows, I've, I've been seeing those things. And then there's these little wood words that say pumpkin patch, I've really been wanting that. But let me know what I should look for tonight, and thank you all so, so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!